last Thursday night's live stream, we set out to find Vlad Midstrader's short circuit super speedway in the Euclid galaxy. We punched in the coordinates and we were off to Earbink Arty system discovered by Captain Richard. It's always a good sign when you come out of a glyph portal and you see all sorts of uh, markers and beacons and signs of life. And there's a base right there, which we immediately went and checked out. Turns out there was 34 bases on this planet. But here we are looking for this short circuit super speedway. We started looking for bases and together we did find many. This one here was the closest we found though to that short circuit super speedway. But we kept on looking because this planet was hopeful and there were so many bases there to check out. Hopefully we'd find a speedway somewhere. There you are. Whoa, whoa! Orbital base. Oh, oh, check this thing out, dude. Did you see this? Yes, I'm standing on top of it. Oh my god, dude! Just check this out. Can you land on it? Oh, my, it says my spaceship is here, but I can't seem to get to it. Let me turn around, maybe I can spot it. I mean, technically it should be in the shuttle bay, right? Yeah. <laughs> All right, so let's go around the back end of this thing. In the, in the live stream, I did not actually see it underneath there, but there it is. If you take a good look at it, it's right there. Can't go okay. space. I fell off, so I'm going to have to get my ship and come back up. Magically teleport you inside the ship. All right, we are standing on board the Enterprise. Roll right up on next to you there. Yeah, there. After Citrus found the hotspot to be able to actually get into his ship, I wanted to go on the quick penny tour here. So I'm going to blast my way through. I love it. They put the port up there. It was great. I loved this base. This was just so well done. The outside was perfect. And just see how much it took from the inside to make the outside was great. But my favorite part was launching my ship. This is so cool. I highly recommend you come here just to do this. Who had any idea you could dock upside down? What a brilliant design idea. And this was just so much fun. This was so much fun. Citrus and I just did it a couple times each. It was just too cool. Highly recommend you come here and check it out. So this system was totally full of surprises. And of course, I had to do it again just one more time. That is super pretty. This is a really pretty planet. Well, look up in the sky. Where's my Enterprise? And, oh, there it is. Oh my god, that is so cool. Quick flyby of these bases. But as we continued to explore around the planet, we realized that was not the only super cool base on the planet. Check out this one here. This was an electromagnetic power station floating, hovering out above the coast. And it was just absolutely amazing. It's all lit up and beautiful these cool railings around the landing pads there and as you can see as we're turning look at all the bases on this planet it's just amazing absolutely amazing it's well worth coming here so didn't realize at first what i was looking at i mean obviously it's architecturally beautiful and it lights up but upon further investigation i realized that this whole thing was built on top of an electromagnetic power source this is an electromagnetic power base absolutely fantastic and just look how cool this is right down to every detail where everything crisscrosses and is put together to build this structure is just absolutely amazing. It was just so cool to see this and it just gives me so many ideas. It's like, wow, this is really inspiring. This is a really well done base. Absolutely fantastic. So glad we came here. And although so far we have not found any race courses, the bases that we have found have all been just absolutely mind blowing. This is definitely well worth a look to come to this particular sector. The wow factor. Super cool. Absolutely amazing. But wait, there's more. Oh, I like the idea with the landing pads. Uh, I like that. They're all kind of jammed in together like that. Huh. I think uh, you Thunder did that up on his face, too. Thunder kind of redid it a little bit, I think, and it looks better now. Uh, I'll have to check that out. Yeah, I, I aimed for a landing pad, and it put me over here. <laughs> Yeah, well done. Their valet is top notch here. <laughs> nice. Oh man, so what do we got going on here? Whoa, let's get out of the water. That is a big ass building. Yes. Looks cool. It has that sort of like almost Japanese style to it. And these like farming things. It's this, uh. Yeah, livestock unit, that's right. Man, 
I wonder what it takes to get like people's bases featured because I, many of the bases on this planet I think are, are feature worthy. That would just be something cool. There's all kinds of stuff going on inside here. Still no race course, but you know what? Rabbit holes abound. Portal, yeah. There we go. Or am I stuck on something? I'm clearly stuck on something. I tend to walk backwards and sideways in this game a lot. Nip nip buds, dudes. My dudes. You betcha. Back to my ship and roll one up. <laughs> Is there more nip nip buds? Yeah. Uh, every floor except the top floor. <laughs> every floor. Someone clearly. Yeah, this is a total grow house. I love it. <laughs> Every floor. Let's check it out. He wasn't kidding. Every floor. So, folks, if you need nip nip buds, there is a place to go for that. Oh my god. And this is it. Floor number three. Take a look out and about. Look at the dinosaur with the glowing necklace. And more nip dip buds. <laughs> and heading up. Heading on up. To the top. <laughs> and more nip dip buds. Jesus. It would be cool if they allowed NPCs to roll around inside of our bases. Like the way they populate the freighters. I think that would just bring a lot more life to them. I did see somebody with a micro build for like a bar in their base where they used one of those like uh, science stations. Oh, oh, that's a good idea. And they built around it and it looked like you had a bartender at. Oh, I'm sold. It was really cool. <laughs> I love that idea. No. A little bummed I haven't found the race course, but I am pretty excited about all these bases. Well, I think I might have to take it offline, and, but I'll look around a little bit more first. In the end, we did not end up finding the race course for whatever reason, whether it's a glitch or it's no longer there, we do not know. Um, but we did find many amazing bases, and here are the glyph portal coordinates for this planet, this system. If you want to come here and check it out for yourself, it is amazing. Again, we didn't find the race course, but we did find really cool bases, so here you go. I hope you're all having a great day, and thank you for watching. Have a great Damn, night. Man, it's crazy. Fly safe.